Dunder Mifflin is about to be sold, but first an investment banker has to drop by and sign off on our branch. And I'm pretty nervous about it. And I'm making some cosmetic tweaks. The principles that I'm applying to the office are the same ones that have made Lady Gaga a star. Hi. Hello, Eric Ward. Welcome to Dunder Mifflin. I am Computron, your answer to everything. Hello. Hello. I see you've met Computron, our virtual helper. Hi, Michael Scott. Welcome, welcome. Computron is just one of the many modern devices that I have incorporated into the office. Watch this. Computron. Yes. What is the world's largest ocean? Calculating. Calculating. Pacific. Pacific Ocean. Pretty cool, huh? Would you like to hang up your coat? Yes. There is a rack behind you, Mr. Ward. Oh. Thank you, Computron. Feel free to use any of the hooks. That's enough, Computron. OK. I thought it was a pretty good idea. We have Dwight's voice passed through all the speakerphones in the office. Buyer walks in, thinks that we have a friendly supercomputer who runs the place. Had I actually had a supercomputer, he might have told me that that was a terrible idea. Any messages? Yes, the governor called. He said thank you. Well, tell him I told you so. What's the second message? The treasury called. Dunder Mifflin paper is being used for counterfeit currency. That's how good it is. Well, that's the price you pay for being the best. Hello, Stanley. Hi. Michael offered me the day off with pay. Said I deserved it for working so hard all these years. I'm gonna have me some nice... Yeah. Cynthia, if you don't come get these dogs from jumping on me, I swear I'll go home to my wife. For the record, not on board with fake Stanley. Although I get it. Ah, this is our creative think space. Google has one of these. What if we ran the whole thing backwards? Total paradigm shift. Look at that. See what the little one's doing? She's making some sweaters for the kittens. Sometimes they get cold at night, so we try to help them out. That's what's great about this place. Got something for everyone, whether you're into cutting edge thinking or pilgrim values. Would you like a kitten? He cannot have a kitten. Give him a kitten. No. You have plenty of kittens. Angela dated Computron a while back. Uh, I'm allergic to kittens. Listen, yeah. I just need to check out your warehouse and then talk to your HR guy. That is pretty much the only reason that I came here today. Okay. Well, I thought I'd show you around a little bit since right. you made the trip out. And I got us reservations at Cooper's Seafood. You like lobster? You've had lobster before, right? Yeah. They make the best Maine lobster in the world. They'll love it. Mulyam in Tel Aviv is better. No, Computron. Actually, I think Cooper's is the best. You're going to love it. Are you calling me wrong? Oh, my God. Computron is never wrong. Shut it, Computron. Computron is truth. Bow down before Computron. Once again, Dwight has just taken it too far. Who is this Dwight? 